Hello, Hello friends. friends, and welcome to hypnoramblings.com with the English, English sisters. sisters. Hello, we were having a cup of uh, coffee this morning, actually cappuccino, wasn't it? Yeah, it was cappuccino at the local bar where we yes. always go to, the little coffee bar in Grotta Ferrata. <laughs> <laughs> Just outside Rome. Actually, it's really lovely because it's near Frascati. Isn't yeah, it? it's gorgeous. Yeah. It's a gorgeous place to live. You may have heard of Frascati wine. Mm. Mm. It's quite um, it's quite well known. Yeah, it's quite enchanting looking, isn't it? Because you 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 hear about this Frascati wine, you know, all your life when you're growing up, but then you actually come here and it's all over the place. Doesn't yeah. It? yeah, you actually become used to it. I mean, it's in every shop. Mm. Yeah, it's and a lot of local wine. Yeah, and the locals just obviously just becomes a local thing. Yeah, and you just become accustomed to it. You know, the good you life. Get used to it. You get used to it. It's amazing what you get used to. You know, when you're driving past these villages, which is so beautiful. You just see the, you know, mm. the, the rambling hills and the uh, it's so beautiful. The vines and the olive trees and you know some of the people that actually live here. Wow, oh, then they don't. They, you know, they can't actually see all of this. They can't Just see a shame. it. No, we can see it because we weren't born here, mm. and we can fully appreciate the beauty of you know the location where we are. But the locals here, they just say, well, yeah. But they always say, ah, where are you from? We say London and they say, ah, that, that's a beautiful city. You know, why on earth have you come to live here in this yeah, small village? Yeah, that's... Yeah, we think, wow, well, there's sunshine here. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, look around. It's so gorgeous. Every day is a bit like a holiday. Mm. Well, it is for us, isn't it? It is. Yeah. Anyway, what were we talking uh, about at coffee? Well, we were we were talking mm. about watermelons, and um, I don't know how the conversation came up. No, we can't remember because it's the middle of winter now, so it's yeah. not something you eat in the winter usually. No, well, especially here. I think we, we were thinking have... about seeds, weren't we? We were, we were. And the watermelon we seed just popped into mind, mm. and we were thinking about how amazing this fruit is because. It just grows from this tiny little seed planted into the ground and it develops into this enormous <laughs> juicy it fruit. It grows <laughs> so quickly though. It I mean, does grow yeah, quickly. Trees, they grow from seeds as well. But to take root in here, this watermelon, it's just amazing. It takes a couple of months it takes to grow. And there I mean, when's it planted? I think they plant them almost sort of early June or something. Yeah, and then by the end of August, or is it the end of August? It's a little bit tall. Before August. And it's all like more August that you get these. Maybe sometimes they put them in greenhouses or whatever. Oh, maybe they do. I remember when we were little, they used to just plant them out like in June and they used to sort of harvest them at the end of summer. Yeah, that's Didn't right. They? In Spain. Yeah, yeah in Spain. Yeah. Well, anyway, we were talking about <laughs> these watermelons, and we were talking about the fact that if you are what you eat, and then if you eat healthily, then perhaps you are also what you think. Yeah. And that <laughs> I mean, that's food for thought, isn't it? That's food for thought, because if you are what you think, then if you wake up in the morning and you have nice thoughts going through your head, through your mind, then, you know, how are you going to feel throughout that day? Throughout the day, yeah. you're going to feel good. It's going to make you feel good if you're thinking pleasant good. thoughts and good you know, thoughts. healthy thoughts. Could we use that word? We can, I think. Healthy thoughts. But on the other hand, if, you know, if you're thinking uh, contaminated, contaminated, unhealthy thoughts for oh, your own yeah. mind, uh, which so many people, you know, can end up doing without realizing it. Mm. And if you actually think about it, we tend to run like movies in our brain, mm. in our minds, about events. 
Mm. Which we think they're just thoughts, but really we're actually unconsciously we're running these processes over and over and over again. If you actually become aware of your thoughts, mm. that's when you can really make a change. Because you can choose to, you know, just sort of get rid of those thoughts that you don't really need. You can sort of bin them like in the past just screen you know we've got that little bin I mean we're quite fortunate now because we've got a lovely new Mac and we just there's actually a little picture of a bin and you actually just yeah, throw, we love that. throw them in and they even make a little noise when yeah. you put them in mm. and you'll go Krush. that's right yeah because <laughs> yeah. you can just get rid of all those you know thoughts that you think well, well I don't want that let's put it in the bin yeah why do I need that you know, do I really need to worry? They call it a chestino, which is a sort of let's throw it down there, and let's yeah. put it in the away waste in the waste bin. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's what you can really do with your thoughts as well. Yeah. In the same way you can eat nice, healthy food that makes you feel good too. Uh, it's in, we, we're thinking the same way you can think nice, healthy thoughts that make you feel good. Because in the end, that's what happens. Your whole state changes, doesn't it? And it's also about creating a habit of thinking healthy thoughts. Because if you just, you know, just do it once in a while, it's not going to really work, is it? No, we're <laughs> not talking about those kind of just no. affirmations saying, I'm a great person, I'm a great no, person. No. It's that kind not of that way. kind of thing it's a different kind of thing it's actually sort of really looking around you and appreciating what you have and mm. isn't it you know and, that, yeah, and if you really you know if you have got a, a, a like a negative thought or a bad thought you think it's bad you say you know how does this thought is this thought any good for me does it does it serve a purpose do I need this thought is it trying to warn me of something if it is obviously you know take action and do something about Mm. But half the time, these thoughts are just really quite useless. Yeah. I mean, at least in, personally, we have yeah. found that. And we mm. actually do work on it every day, sort of mm. just think, you know, if there is a, just a thought that just sort of comes in. And they just come in, don't you? A bit you? negative yeah. kind yeah. of thing. You just think, do I need this do thought? Need is it, it going to... Do I want, I want it? it? Do I want it? Do I like it? Do I like it? Should I take it? Yeah, shall I, I keep, keep it, it? <laughs> or leave it? Mm. Or throw it away? Mm. <laughs> you know, it's really is a matter of uh, choice. Choice, yeah. That's what we were thinking. Creating more choice. Mm. This is For your own mind. I mean, you know, when you go to a bar in Italy, you can choose to have a cappuccino, a mochaccino, a espresso. I mean, there is so much choice, isn't yeah. there? Yeah. So, I mean, why don't you, we do the same with our brains, with our yeah. minds? Instead of just letting them run on mm. their own. We can choose. choose what we want to have inside them. And we can feel quite good about choosing too. We do feel good, don't we? <laughs> well, we do. Yeah, we do. Absolutely. And just do it on a daily basis. And as you notice as you do this, you probably will find it quite relaxing. And you sort of feel, I think, well, you know, I don't want to speak from personal experience, but it makes us feel free. That's right. To choose. Free to choose. Mm. Yes. Mm. Okay then. Okay. Bye bye. See bye you bye. soon. And you know, don't forget to tell your friends to come and visit us at hypnoramblings.com. Bye. bye.